Hi, I'm Duncan Lucas, I'm passionate about fish, and in this video we're going to work on a Welsh whiting. Whiting is quite an unusual fish, this is a very large one. But basically any white fish, cod, haddock, coley, whiting, we fill it in the same sort of way. I'm going to show you how to fillet this fish and train you to do it. And to do this I'm actually going to take the head off. It makes it easier to fillet the fish and as you develop your skills then you can start to leave the head on. Of course, to fillet the fish I'm going to use my filleting knife. First thing I'm going to do is remove the head to make it easy to fillet the fish. The pectoral fin which is connected to the part of the body of the fish which is referred to as the nape is left on the head and I've cut tight round the head on the first side. I'm going to turn the fish over, lift the pectoral fin on the second side, work tight round the back of the head. Then I'm going to remove the head from the fish by holding the head in my left hand, the fish in my right hand, break the spine and remove all the flesh from the back of the head trying to get as great a yield as possible. And then we're going to start to fillet the fish. Always ensure that you stand at the tail end of the fish. The first side I'm going to fillet is the side underneath on the belly side of the fish. I'm going to start at the tail put my knife on the skin on top of its anal fin and then I draw the knife into the fillet and down the length of the fish and I'm only cutting as deep as the lateral line and then just tease away the fin all the way to the front of the fillet and we've actually filleted half of the fish at that stage. And I'm going to turn the fish round and I'm going to insert the knife into the back of the fish on top of the dorsal fin. You lie the knife on top of the dorsal fin at a slight angle and just guide the knife through the skin. Once you feel it lie on the bone, then very carefully pull the knife and the top hand follows the blade down the length of the fish. And again, I'm only cutting as deep as the lateral line down the length of the fish. At this stage, I'm just going to tease my knife right through the fillet and release the tail from the fish. Then I'm going to open the back of the fish up and just make sure I've gone right down into the fish on top of the rib cage. And then with the tip of your knife, you angle the blade following the rib cage up the fish. Then we need to take the tip of the blade through the pin bones. And we do two or three quick movements till we feel the fillet lift. And then we follow the rib cage down into the fish and we produce a beautiful white fish fillet. The black skin that's on the fillet we can trim off straight away to change the whole visual presentation of the fillet. This leaves you with a nice white fillet. We're trying to shave it and trim it and refresh the cut edge of the fish. And there's our first white fish fillet. We're going to turn the fish over. We're going to start again by following the back of the fish on top of the dorsal fin. We start at the tail, draw the knife into the skin. Once you're on top of the bone, then we need to put a slight bend in the knife and draw the knife all the way up the length of the fish. It's not a race, nice and slowly. You can see the knife bouncing along the bone all the way to the head. And that is the cut that I've made. I'm now going to sit the fish up slightly, and lift the fillet away from the rib cage, tease the fillet with the tip of the knife, use the tip of the knife to go through those difficult pin bones, and then I can follow the rib cage right down onto the work surface and follow the bone all the way down the length of the tail, and we've got our second fillet. Tidy as you go, clean work surface is important. Now I need to make the second fillet look identical to the first. The way we're going to do that is we're going to actually trim that silver skin, black skin away from the fillet with the blade of the knife. Just shave in the fillet to change the presentation. If you've left any fins along the underside of the fish, you just use your knife to trim them away. Trim that bit of silver skin away there. We're changing the visual presentation just to make the fillet look absolutely perfect. 
even these cut edges that are slightly discoloured because that's where the fisherman gutted the fish need to be trimmed away. And there we've got two absolutely beautiful white fish fillets.